Hey everybody, this is Javon Pera. Wanted to give you the last minute opportunity to take advantage of the workshop today, getting stuff done. So here's a little tip about one of the things we're gonna go over today on this amazing workshop and it's about scheduling. And by the way, did this workshop last week and I had a room full of top agents that were just ecstatic about the information that was able to give them an ability to, to get an overwhelming number of stuff done without having the stress. Wouldn't it be amazing to be able to manage your whole crazy busy life without stressing out about it, to have peace in your moments? What that does for you is it lets you uh, influence more effectively. The people around you, your potential clients or your current clients, they, they want to work with you and they're more likely to refer. So that will enable them to say yes when you ask them for referrals, which I'm sure you're doing, right? Each opportunity. So here's a tip for today. And it's, it's about how to, to manage all the stuff. So one little tip that's pulled out of the giant system, which by the way, I want you to come or at least call me and we can set up a one-to-one -one and go over it, is just getting the stuff out of your mind and onto paper. So a, number, a couple things that I do to be able to do that is I use email or I use Evernote, which is a great uh, software that allows you to manage lists wherever you go. So if you update the list on your computer, it's always on your phone. And if you update it on your phone, it's always on your computer. So wherever you go, you have that information. So what I do is if something's in my head, I need to get it on the paper so that I don't have to worry about it in my head. Because what'll happen is if you manage more than one thing, one task in your head, it creates stress because you're only able to really concentrate and do one thing at a time. And if you try to start doing multiple things at a time, it goes past the capacity of what this prefrontal cortex can do, this creative create a solution finding part of your brain. It goes past what it can do and, and it causes anxiety and stress and you're not able to function. So in order to do that and not forget about the things that you have to do, write it down somewhere. And so what I like to do is have a digital. So I will email myself tasks all the time so that I can manage them throughout the day and go through and put them in the system. So at a very minimum, you want a to-do list. So I, I have my to-do list in Evernote and I can explain how to do that. And I'll always add it and be prioritizing so the next thing that's important is at the top. And the second thing that is essential in the system of having a, an overwhelming number of things to do and not being stressed about it is using your calendar effectively. So here's what you use your calendar for. You only put things on your calendar that have a specific day that it needs to be done and a specific time that it needs to be done. And you don't put just to-dos that you need to do whenever because when that happens, your calendar gets cluttered and then you end up treating your calendar as, well, I'll get to it when I can. What you want to do is if it shows up on your calendar, you do it. And I like to say, treat my calendar as sacred. As in, I'm not going to reason with it. If I put it on there, it's because it's going to support my goals, my most important goals, and I'm going to do it no matter what. It's as if you had a $30 million listing appointment, which I have a friend of mine who actually has had such appointments and gotten the listing and she made a lot of money. Now, what if you had that kind of appointment? Would you treat that appointment lightly? If someone called and said, hey, I need, I need you during this time, you wouldn't say, uh, okay, I'll switch this $30 million listing appointment around. No, no, you wouldn't do that. You would do it no matter what. What I want you to do is put things on your calendar that you're gonna do no matter what. And you don't have to, when you check it multiple times a day so you can know what you should be doing, you don't have to think about it. Uh, do I wanna move my prospecting around? Oh, do I wanna move those cold calling the session around? Do, do I wanna move this, uh, this meeting with a past client around? Do I, you know, those kind of things. If you put it on there, it's because you thought through your goals and you know this activity is gonna get me there and you do it. And then you tell other people when you're free. Now, when you tell other people that you're busy and you only have three spots available and you give them those spots, what happens is you actually create in the other person that's talking to you a different level of respect. Wow, you're busy. Obviously, you're good at what you're doing. Oh, wow, I, okay, I'll, I'll try to fit into your schedule. Just like calling a doctor. If a doctor answered the phone and just 
made an available time whenever you were free, you might think, wow, this doctor is, uh, maybe they're not that good. No, when you call a doctor, you get the receptionist. Receptionist gives you certain amounts of time. You go in, you meet with like, not even the receptionist, but an admin, and then a nurse, and then the doctor. So create your system. You're gonna create value for the other person and then stick to it. Put the most important, the three most important things every day that you need to do to get towards your goals on your calendar and then do it no matter what. And then chunk those committed times into 20 minute chunks and don't be interrupted. If someone needs to, if you need to make a call, well wait at least 20 minutes, you know, put it on your answering machine. I'll make sure I, I call you back within an hour and you're checking every 20 minutes if you have to, but, but not it be, to be interrupted on what you're doing right now. And then make sure you write down those to-do lists, those to-do items on some sort of to-do list that you can access wherever you go. So please let me know if I can help you with this. Um, I'm doing this workshop today, but I can do some other ones. And, and uh, my name is Javon Perry once again with Paraloans and uh, paraloans.com, paragroup.com. You can find my information there. Uh, my phone number, 949-463-9898, Javon at paragroup.com. Let's get some stuff done. I want you to be that, that beast in your industry that is going to make it happen, that's going to get the deals, that's going to create confidence in whoever you're, you're sitting with and whoever you're, you're working with. And I can help you close more deals if you let me. So have a great day. I hope this is helpful and I hope you can make today's workshop. Uh, it's going to be in Irvine, California. Uh, I'll put it on the email, the, the, uh, the location and uh, have a great one.